Hi everyone, this is a short video to let everyone know about some minor changes I've made to the jewelry kit. The installation process has been simplified. In the previous versions of the kit, after you installed the kit, you still had to manually install the toolbar. The toolbar is now automatically installed and opened by the script at the end of the installation process. If you had another version of the jewelry kit already installed, it will close any toolbars associated with that at the beginning of the installation process. In the previous versions of the kit, the materials dialog listed the file names of the materials, and that was a little difficult to read. Now it lists the actual names of the materials. Also, there is now a back option on most pages, so you can back up to the previous page if needed. The Extra Objects dialog also now uses the actual names of the objects, and the jump rings have been moved to their own section. And the jump ring page also has a back option as well. The free kit also now includes the Grasshopper jump ring tool. I actually added this in a few versions ago, but I don't think I announced it. So. If you have the free version and you would like to have the Grasshopper jump ring tool, be sure to upgrade to the current version. And these updates aren't available just for Rhino 8, but also for Rhino 6 and Rhino 7. Remember, if you have the paid version of the kit, you can access the new files by simply logging into your CG Trader account and clicking on Purchases. And these updates are also available in the free version. And so updating to the new version should be as simple as downloading the new files and then going through the installation process again. The installation process will overwrite the old version of the kit. Now, if you don't use the material loader or the extra objects loader very often, then going through the process of installing the new version may not be worth it for you. But for those who are interested in it, I wanted to go ahead and make this quick video letting them know that this small update is available to them. And I'll put the links to both the free version and the paid version in the description below the video. All right, that's it for this video. Thanks everyone for watching. I hope to see all of you in future videos.